I am back from the store. I went out of town for a couple hours to get some things. I went to Target to get my coffee creamer because they didn't have it locally here. And I had like a certain kind of coffee creamer in the afternoon. And then I went to Trader Joe's to pick up some produce, some groceries that we needed. And then um, I picked up some gnocchi for dinner tonight. I'm super excited about that. I'm back home. I am on the computer because I have some much needed emails to catch up on. I have some videos to edit of my own that need to go up this week. By the way, I went to Target and they recently, like literally a couple weeks ago, just had a collab with I believe the brand is Stony Clover. And they had the display fully stocked, which I guess is super rare but they also had everything 50% off. Even though I have no idea what the brand is, I guess it is like super popular for like makeup bags. They have really cute like pastel items. And speaking of pastel, I got these little press on nails. Something to like switch up for the springtime, I don't know. Um, I never really go for this color, but it caught my eye. I actually got these at Target. Funny enough. They are the Olive and June Press On Nails. I actually really like this brand. I had um, Press Ons in like a nice like pink color. I just got one of their polishes, like a sparkly um, glitter color, but I got these periwinkles. It's in the color BP and they only had the medium length. So what I did is I just applied them and then cut and followed them down to the shape I like. Not bad at all, but super cute for the springtime. And I have worn these press-ons before. I had the shade KG, which is like a pretty like pink color. That's what I like to go for is like pretty pinks and nudes. And those things lasted me like two and a half weeks before they started shipping and in total about a month. So I'm gonna be sticking with this color for the next couple weeks. I really, really like them. It's just something completely new. So now I'm gonna go on to my computer and I'm going to catch up on some emails and some other work that I mentioned earlier. And I'm probably just gonna do that for a couple hours until I'm gonna make dinner. And then I wanna show you guys my favorite hair care products right now. One of the products I'm like in love with, and I think this is gonna be like one of the staples in my routine now. Um, but I'll get to that once I'm done and I can show you guys how to use it and all that kind of stuff. But as of right now, I'm gonna get to work. products that I was mentioning earlier that I wanted to talk to you guys about. So this is from Odell Beauty. I wanted to try out their smoothing shampoo and conditioner. Um, this is just for extra moisture, frizz control, and shine. And these products definitely do that. Um, I definitely have like a problem with frizzy hair because my hair is pretty wavy and I tend to air dry my hair so it gets really frizzy really quick. Um, so this has helped a lot. I've seen a major difference, but they actually sent me another product and it's their air dry styler And I feel like that's my favorite product I have ever had for hair care. So I'll definitely link this down below I mean, they're not sponsoring me to talk about this and then in between doing my shampoo and conditioner I like to comb out my hair in the shower with this t3 um, wide comb brush so I like to comb through this to get some tangles out and then I put the conditioner over top of it. So as you guys know, I definitely air dry my hair a lot more than I blow dry it. So when I saw this product, I had to try it. So this is again the Odell Beauty Air Dry Styler. It smooths, conditions, and gives soft separation for air dry perfection. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm going to brush out my hair. And I've noticed that the conditioner helps with like detangling my hair. I mean, I have a lot of hair. So definitely another problem that I have is like tangly hair, especially when my hair is like straight. Another thing that I really like about Odell Beauty is it's a clean hair care brand. And here's like all of the information in the back. It even tells you like what hair type is best for each product. Super amazing. So I just like to take a little bit of this. It comes in like a gel form. Kind of brush it out with my fingers. 
mostly on like the ends of my hair and then if I have a little extra in my hands then I'll kind of go towards the top of my hair but this is like the most convenient product because I'm not even someone that like knows a lot about hair care I just like use my shampoo and conditioner and sometimes dry shampoo so this air dry styler is amazing for like beginners in hair because you just have to put this gel in and then your hair dries really nicely. I've only tried this one other time and it actually like really defrizzed my hair and like made it super smooth and all. So I'm just gonna leave my hair back and I'm gonna do my skincare. So in the shower I use my Panoxyl face wash and it's like pretty tough on my skin. Um, so if I don't use that then I will go in with the Good Molecules Overnight Exfoliating Treatment. This stuff has worked wonders on my skin lately, but because that face wash is so like rough on my skin, then I'm not going to use this. So instead, I'm actually going to use something hydrating because it is pretty drying of a face wash. So my go-to serum right now is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Hyaluronic Acid Serum. The camera's like not focusing on anything I'm showing. Um, I love their moisture cream a lot. I feel like it's really... Uh, similar to another hydrating water-based cream I had. I want to say it's from Fresh, but it's not. But I just take a couple drops. I put it on my skin. My skin gets super red. It's super sensitive. So, of course, when I touch my face, it's going to get red. But I've actually seen a major improvement in my skin since drinking a lot of water. Recently, I got a half gallon water bottle for Easter and I have been using that thing every single day. I've been drinking all my water and I've seen major improvements with like my skin. Like a lot of my scarring on my cheeks is going away. I'm feeling amazing. Um, so it's definitely gone down but obviously you can't tell because I just got out of the shower and it was a steamy shower so my face is red from that. And then um, sometimes I'll go in with a moisturizer, but tonight I'm feeling a little luxurious. And I'm using the Sunday Riley CEO Afterglow Cream. Look at the pigment of this product. It's insane. And it also came with a cute little spoon. So I just like to scoop some up and put this on my face. It kind of makes my face look a little yellow or orange, which I don't mind because like I'm going to be going to bed soon, so it doesn't really matter. But if I don't use this, I'll just use my basic like moisturizing lotion. And um, I use that for like my face and body. I have a smaller um, little container of that in my skincare fridge because I like a cold moisturizer. Then I'll go on top with this Laneige um water sleeping mask this is amazing if you guys have like dry skin or it's like the summertime and your face dries out from like being out in the sun put that on overnight and like put it on as a moisturizer you'll wake up and you will feel so hydrated i swear and then top everything else off with my laneige lip sleeping mask this is the berry one i believe oh my gosh you guys i love putting this on at night I usually put this on at night and first thing in the morning and I just use it like a lip balm. It's amazing. Um, but I'm going to clean my ears and that is my vlog. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this little day in my life vlog. I know it's a little chattier and a shorter vlog, but if you like these kind of vlogs, let me know down in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and follow all of my other socials. They'll be linked down below. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog really soon. Bye!